Hi guys, here from the old town of jo uh, Tiflisi. It's actually quite a lot of things still to be renovated when you look at it. it this is basically um, a little bit down a hill from the Freedom Square. It's the old bazaar if you want to see. That's uh, what they have, I think, the Mother Georgia. It's a little bit like a Mother Ukraine up there. And here you see a lot of buildings still in renovation. It's booming everywhere. There is work done. This is the old uh, part of the town and it's uh, very nice, but uh, still a major need for investment. Some of it is happening. It is, reminds me, it doesn't look so different to what I saw four years ago, but of course they're doing a lot everywhere to renovate, but it looks still, this is a very nice square, I remember, and it's a beautiful place full of old buildings and very nice uh, to invest and to see this is a little bit improved yeah actually dramatically improved yeah i showed you some pictures this was in 2018 before my podcasting career they have just made pictures this place is actually very nice now and the investment has really revitalized this part of the old town and here there is a lot of new renovated buildings and seemingly more is ongoing here in this old town it was all breaking down and here you see up there this i guess it's also mother georgia the monument you can see yes i think you can see it up there no? here exactly I will. thanks a lot thanks a lot yeah i lose my cables already people start to help me that I'm not completely making a confused impression. This is very beautiful here and it has really upgraded. It has been upgraded in the last four years. Yeah? Uh, there is still enormous work to be done in the old town of Tiflisi. But the last years of uh, reforms and investments have been really tremendously improving uh, this part of the town. You see, the Soviet Union was an evil empire, they have done almost nothing for old town renovation and it was complete disaster. Four years ago, last time I was here, it looked uh, dramatically like this one here. You see, I think it's easy to document. You see, this is now investment and progress and DCFDA, European Georgia, <laughs> yes. And then you see the past. This is the new. It's investment, it's progress, it's uh, security, which leads then to people investing money. And this is the past, yeah? inherited from a long gone past when there was better trade interconnectivity and Georgia interconnected in the world trade in whatever, 200 years. And then there came the tragic times, the Soviet times, and they were totally disconnected. And now they are gradually getting to be part of the world economy again. You see the renovation effort. This is all in the last years. This is the leftover of the Soviet Union. They left everything to rot. And new Georgia is now here. And Europe and international capital is here uh, to help, to invest. It were mostly domestic investors, I guess. But uh, look what the substance is. It has been very beautiful and it will be of course uh, very beautiful in the future again and then we have to of course <coughs> have security here because only with security investment makes sense because who would like to invest when there's no security this again is an investment project here and you see that this is the past uh, the leftovers of the soviet union 30 years of chaotic transition and then you see this is the results and then I'm coming here and I will show you the future. This is the past, here's the future. You see it quite simple and quite easy that the DCFDA, the European direction, the reforms, they lead then to investors domestic and internationally uh, risking their money on old town renovation and then by the time from a destroyed dust boil in which the Soviet Union left over <coughs> it's gradually because the Soviet Union again an evil empire nobody invested nobody renovated nobody did anything decent 
they just left industrial disasters and nuclear disasters. And so gradually here up there, you see that's already, I mean, that's a very beautiful church up there. You see the gondola here, this is the old town. It's very beautiful. It will be a European cultural asset of first rank again, once everything is renovated and all these beautiful old churches are renovated as well. This anti-clerical, anti-cultural Soviet Union left only a disaster. And now it's up to the international investment community, the Georgian investment community, to turn from the rubble of the past, <laughs> the ancient treasures, they will be all renovated. And I'm sure when I come back in some years again, all these really wonderful old buildings with their character and their style, they will be renovated, they will be invested, as we have seen it in for example, Montenegro, it was in similar bad condition or also many places of the Balkans in similar bad conditions. And then came the turn to the West, NATO backed security, European prosperity and stability. And suddenly things got much better. And so it was very good. It's a nice place. Very good. Okay, I'm convinced. Yeah. Hello from the old town. This is very beautiful. Now I need to eat before I break down. And that's what I will do. Best regards. Thanks a lot. Bye.